Yana Beeger and then Alicia Sacramoni. And Sacramoni, after what happened on the uneven bars, isn't thinking about the podium any longer. This is going to be a major changing of the guard, as we might have thought, with none of the Olympians coming back. Well, as she goes cleanly through this exercise, she is the only athlete of the top four to do what every single one of them tells us before the meet begins. They want to go eight for eight. And a big skill for her right here, blind landing. Oh, God. And you know, that's just as devastating as a oh. fall, putting your hands down. So it's the same deduction. That'll be about five tenths of a point. And here, a signature move. Well, did she touch? I think so, yeah. This is, boy, she made it all the way through to the last event. First Bal balance beam again. Yep, first event as a, as a senior. Looked like she's been here a million times. And she's looked that way in practice as well. Every day, the same, just the same, consistent. Yeah, I've been amazed at, at how, how great she has looked. She had a very serious injury about 10 months ago, dislocated her kneecap and had surgery on that, rehabilitated. And to look this great all the way through, quite a testament to her. This is a very difficult dismount she has planned. It's a double front, blind landing. She takes a lot of risk throughout the entire routine, but especially on this dismount. Yeah. Think about that for a moment. Dislocated kneecap. Okay. Yeah, well enough okay. to pull right. off that. A lot to be proud of, though. In many, many ways, did a tremendous job. First time senior. I mean, this was the only flaw in the competition was this front with a half, just a little bit off, maybe could have saved it. She tried. Same skill we saw Chelsea Memo fall on earlier in the evening. So all four of the top athletes take a fall on balance beam at these championships. Amazing.